Beetles are everywhere, but we rarely stop and acknowledge just how plentiful these insects are. And though they seem powerless by their appearance, these minuscule creatures are capable of destruction that's beyond our imagination. When these insects set to work together, they can easily turn any edible substance into dust in a matter of a few hours. If this sounds like a fluke, do check out the whole video and decide for yourself. Because today, we will show you 15 horrifying moments of beetles destroying everything in their path. Number 15. A Pomus Beetle Attacks Frog Frogs can feed on just about anything that they find in the wild. That includes insects, slugs, worms, snails, and even beetles. These creatures are smaller than the predator and supposed to be an easy meal, although sometimes beetles can unexpectedly turn the tables. Two Apomus beetles find a frog nearby and immediately give chase. Apomus beetles are a type of ground beetles that are known for their mastery of amphibian hunting. The frog becomes alert and leaps away a few times but one of the beetles manages to grab a good bite and latches onto the frog to damage its muscles and nerves as the others join in. The frog relentlessly fights back the murderous insects, but they overpower the amphibian and eat it inside out while it's still alive. An apomus beetle is pitted against an adult frog under a controlled environment. The beetle looks scared and intimidated at first, but just as the frog closes in, the insect strikes first and makes a successful hit. It clings to the frog that leaps frantically to shrug off the insect. Minutes later, the frog becomes partially unresponsive and eventually it's seen mutilated and ripped open while the beetle stays unscathed from the whole event. Number 14. Diving Beetle Attacks Fish With hundreds of beetle species conquering the globe, some of these creatures, like the diving beetles, have evolved into skilled predators with unique abilities that help them to make unexpected kills. Diving beetles have feathered legs to help them adapt to a marine lifestyle. They trap air under their wings to facilitate breathing underwater as they go foraging for food. When this diving beetle spots a tiny fish swimming by, the insect traps the prey and uses its sharp mandibles to rip the victim apart and feed on it. Similar to the previous one, these diving beetles are devouring a fresh catch and are halfway through with the feeding process. The fish is mutilated and in only a couple of minutes, the prey gets devoured to the bones. Number 13. Burying Beetle Destroys Shrew Burying beetles do not make a kill just for the food they derive out of it. There might be other utilities of the dead animal to these insects. A shrew dies naturally, and shortly thereafter, its dead body is discovered by the burying beetles. But instead of devouring the corpse right away, these insects have other plans. The beetles squeeze under the animal, lay on their back, and push the body forward to carry the dead shrew back to their den. Once there, the beetles shave off the shrew's fur and secrete chemicals to decompose the corpse. The female burying beetle lays eggs inside and turns the decaying carcass into a baby food. Number 12. Warrior Beetle Attacks Scorpion Scorpions are no easy catch. They are fast, agile, and have a lethal stinger at the back of their tail that can pose a serious threat to their rivals. But beetles have evolved to survive against tough situations like these, and sometimes, with the correct set of skills and precision, they manage to take down such indomitable opponents too. A warrior beetle and a scorpion are confined in an enclosure, and the beetle wastes no time in attacking the scorpion. It skips the head and aims straight for the tail of the prey. Clearly, the beetle is aware of the scorpion's strength and weaknesses. A head-on combat will be a waste of energy and life-threatening for the beetle. The beetle uses its strong mandibles to clutch and pin down the stinger of its prey. The scorpion tries every possible way to free its tail, but fails miserably. Soon, the attacker manages to sever the tail from the body, leaving the victim defenseless and defeated. This clip further proves that scorpions are nothing but lunch for the warrior beetles. When placed in a similar situation, the two rivals clash aggressively with the only intention of destroying the other. The beetle makes a swift transition between attacking the head and the tail of the scorpion, making it difficult for the victim to set aim. The insect makes a clever move of protecting its underbelly and exposing the hard and sturdy outer layer of the stinger. Failing to make any impact, the scorpion ultimately surrenders to the invincible warrior. Number 11. Beetles Feed on Raccoon Skull Apart from being skilled predators, beetles are scavengers too and occasionally feed on leftover carcasses of dead animals. It's much less effort 
and the security of the meal increases many folds when it doesn't attack or try to run away. When a dead raccoon skull is placed with the vicious flesh-eating beetles, the insects quickly swarm and cover the whole face, devouring the skull in and out, including the tongue. They clean the whole thing to the bones within a couple of hours, leaving no sign of flesh on the whole skull. Number 10. Ground Beetle Eats Snail The slowest and the weakest make the best meal in the wild, and, as predators, beetles are aware of this fact. Snails can't really fight back, and that's why they act as perfect meals for beetles. This ground beetle has pulled out the snail from its shell, and the soft flesh is making a scrumptious meal for the insect. Snails have the shell as a protective layer, and once that is invaded, it becomes an easy lunch to its attackers. The predator's strong and sharp mandibles are digging into the flesh, ripping it off in tiny pieces for better consumption. Unlike the previous clip, this beetle makes its way inside the shell instead of pulling out the snail to devour it. The insect squeezes in and out from the tiny opening, devouring whatever is left in the opening. Number 9. Beetle Attack Slug Slugs are shellless mollusks and have limited defenses to begin with. They tend to avoid places that are frequented by other predators and secrete slimy mucus as secondary defense whenever they feel threatened. This beetle is munching on a slug, and if you notice closely, the mandibles and the forearms are working in impeccable coordination to dismember the sticky victim in lumps. There is little the slug can do to defend itself against its strategic opponent. In an identical situation, this beetle is skillfully using its mandibles and arms like scissors to cut off the slimy slug in tiny mounds of flesh before devouring it. Number 8. Beetle Eats Mouse Even though tackling an adult rodent alive would be too tall a task for the beetles, they are constantly in search of the ones that are either injured, sick, or just dead. And once they do, the beetles feast on the corpse until there is nothing left. These dung beetles are having a whole mouse for lunch, skipping their usual meal of dung. The insects rip the mouse open and devour the flesh down to its veins, organs, and muscles. The leftovers are collected and shaped into a ball, which gets buried in the soil for later use. Number 7. Beetle Attacks Bird Beetles make a common food for the birds, along with other insects, worms, and fishes. They swoop in, nab one of these creatures, and scoot away without any form of protest. But when a bird drops dead on the ground, the beetles surely make the most of the situation. When this beetle finds a dead bird on the ground, it decides to keep the carcass only for itself. To protect its meal from the other predators looking around, the beetle digs out a hole in the ground and buries the whole bird under it to feed on it according to its convenience without worrying about someone else stealing its food. Number 6. Beetles Destroy Snakes A whole snake can last an entire beetle community for several days, and the insects make sure that they can clean the carrion to the bones, not leaving a single strand of flesh on the leftover skeleton. The de-skinned boa constrictor is left in a flesh-eating beetle compound. Under a couple of minutes, the crawling predators rip off every bit of flesh on the snake's body, leaving nothing but a spiky clean skeleton behind. Exhibiting the typical nature of burying beetles, these insects are working on burying the snake for later use instead of devouring it right away. Number 5. Beetles Attack Worms Beetles mostly dominate the ground and scour the surrounding premises for a possible food source. Worms are found in abundance and make go-to meals for the beetles. They take down these worms with minimum effort and mutilate the worms before eating them. A ground beetle ambushes a corn earworm and pins down the prey almost immediately. The worm tries to wiggle out of the predator's grasp but fails to make any successful advance. The beetle injects the mandibles into the worm and pulls out the insides, ravaging its prey completely. This ground beetle is tearing up a dead worm. It climbs on the prey to get a better hold of the victim and works on the flesh with the mandibles to disintegrate the worm before feeding on it. Number 4. Beetles Break Down Dead Squirrel Although a full-grown agile squirrel usually stays out of the reach of ground insects like beetles, a dead squirrel is as good as any other meal for the tiny insects. The flesh-eating beetles are skilled in decomposing any carcass into a pound of dust, as we see in this clip. The insects swarm around the squirrel and bite off the flesh and everything along with it, leaving only the dried bones of an unrecognizable animal. Number 3. Beetles Attacking Caterpillar Caterpillars are vulnerable crawlies that use a number of defenses to protect themselves against any probable danger. The primary shield is their camouflaging ability, followed by hair spines, aggressive behavior, and chemical defenses. 
but beetles have evolved above these and learned how to take down a caterpillar with no collateral injuries. A ground beetle larva attacks a caterpillar and takes down the victim in a few strikes. With no intention of devouring the victim immediately, the beetle leaves the wounded caterpillar in insufferable pain. The tiger beetle is relishing on a freshly hunted caterpillar. Just like any other beetle, this predator is trying to use a similar tactic to break down its prey into edible pieces to feed on it right away. But the beetle is facing some trouble figuring out a favorable place to start digging out its victim. Number 2. Beetle Eats Isopod Isopods are a type of crustacean that can be found on land and water alike. They have a hard, crusty outer layer. And whenever they feel threatened or want to shield against an incoming predator, isopods curl up into a ball to trick its attacker. In this clip, a ground beetle is devouring a small isopod. Although it isn't clear what actually killed the crustacean, clearly none of its defenses are going to save it from becoming the beetle's meal now. Number 1. Beetles Eat Dead Moles Moles frequently feed on insects, and as nature would have it, when moles die, the insects, especially beetles, derive several days' worth of food from the predator that once thrived on them. A lifeless mole is being devoured by innumerable flesh-eating beetles. The insects work on the corpse relentlessly, as a result of which the mole is reduced to a pile of fur and bones at the end of a couple of hours. The mole is approaching similar fate because the beetles are going to town on its carcass. We're pretty sure in just a while, there will be nothing left of this mole other than its bones. That's all for today, folks. Which of these beetle invasions had you on the edge? Let us know in the comments down below. Plus, don't forget to like and share this video with your friends and family. To get more such amazing videos, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon so that you can get notified every time we come with a new video. Have a great day, and we hope to see you soon in another exciting video.